S&P ratings is showing that there is a significant risk of uh, defaults, but it's not something that is going to appear in 2023 because the 2023 maturities seem to be easy to address by the market. It looks like the challenge and the wall of debt maturities is likely to come in 2024, 25 and 26. And this makes sense because if you think about it, a lot of companies have been uh, extending their maturity profile as much as they could when interest rates were extremely low. However, now that extremely low rates are over, what we have is that those maturities that looked attractive in the uh, period of negative real yields is now getting shorter and it's getting closer. So. Uh, we see some interesting trends. The first one is that the number of negative uh, ratings or rating downgrades relative to upgrades is significantly higher than in the past three years. Second, that there are more defaults even if those defaults are limited so far. And third, that the wall of debt maturities is not coming in 2023, but it's certainly ahead of us and getting closer. So we have to pay a lot of attention to this because it's not an easy environment as liquidity and solvency ratios are not improving, they're actually getting worse.